In the meantime, Desha Shah spoke with uh, Maharashtra Election Commissioner J. S. Saharia just hours before the high stake elections in Mumbai civic body. Listen in. This time we have used the modern technology and we have developed a mobile application, True Water. This True Water helps the voter in two different ways. Number one, any person can find out, can search his name in the voter list. And number two, he can find out his polling station and how to reach there. So suppose if I do not know, if I am a voter, if I do not know where to go, where is my polling station, he can download this mobile application and search his polling station and how to approach that, how to reach there very easily. Okay. So how many total number of people they have registered uh, in this particular application? Uh, the total number of, um, as I was mentioning a little while ago, in the whole state it is more than a lakh people have already taken the help of these people. <clears throat> and if you want um, uh, uh, statistics, I can give the statistics as to how many, what number of people, 1,35,000 people have downloaded this application so far, 98,000 people have navigated to uh, find out the polling stations where they have to go and more than 45,000 people have found out the antecedents or the details of their candidates, know, know your candidate. So this mobile application which has been launched only recently is the people are making use of this and taking advantage of this. So on the social media, especially on Twitter, we are seeing a lot of posters and banners where people are saying that you, the State Election Commission has, for the very first time has come up with this uh, uh, innovative idea that you can vote online. So is that true? No. <clears throat> we have not introduced the online voting system as yet. If somebody is talking about, in our name, that is not correct. I, m I will make it very clear. Everybody will have to go to the polling station and vote there at the designated polling station. No other form of voting is allowed at the moment. And uh, my last question to you is, we know for the fact that the excise department has ceased uh, a lot, uh, many, uh, you know, from, right from cash transactions to liquor. So what does the latest record say? Um, see, as far as the ca cash and the liquor seizure are concerned, both the police department takes action against the defaulters and similarly the excise department does it. In the state, wherever the elections are going on, that is 11 Zilla Parishads and 10 municipal corporations, we have seized more than 60 lakhs of rupees cash. And the liquor has been seized in um, 3.22 lakh liters, three, in fact 3.25 lakh liters and also liquor worth 4.5 lakh crore rupees has been seized by our people so far. Okay. And in terms of uh, violation of code of conduct, if you can just specify about, about the 10 municipal corporations and also the different statistics for BMC as well? The model code of violation, the figures which we have got so far, because as you are aware, model code of conduct, the, the complaints go to the respective collectors or municipal commissioner. And they are authorized to take decisions on those complaints at their level. So they send only um, information about those complaints which they have not been able to resolve or which they seek our guidance in that. <clears throat> the number of complaints in the corporation areas so far are 217 and in the Zilla Pashad areas 20. Out, out of this 217 in the 10 corporations, 92 pertain to Mumbai itself. You can watch live TV on our website mbnow.in. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash magic bricks now. And don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at Magic Bricks Now. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com forward slash Magic Bricks Now.